Hey y'all, I'm Lachlith and in today's video I'm going to get into the game that is called Unleaving, but very quickly like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell if you enjoy my content, want to say every time that I post, make sure to ring that bell so you don't miss out on future content from me. But yes, I'm excited to jump into a game called Unleaving. I've seen brief mentions of this game. It came out on March 27th, so last week as to when you are seeing this. It was developed and published by Orangutan Matter. And I also want to give a big thanks to the dev and publisher for providing me a code on Steam because yes, it is released on PC and Steam. So that is where you can get it for yourself. All the links to them and the Steam site are in the description box below. But fine art meets digital interactivity in Unleaving, where you can dive into the world of mixed media, painting come to life. When everything seems hopeless, a child is awakened by the whispers of the last leaf drawn into an imaginary world. Unleaving invites the player into a narrative-driven puzzle platformer where each challenge unfolds within a hand-painted landscape exploring perception and meaning. Now, if y'all were not aware, I went to college for studio art. So fine arts is very special to me. It's not something that I thought I could do in my day to day or even as a job. That's why I didn't pursue it further. I do in the future want to get back into painting because that's something I definitely miss. It comes and goes in waves, but I wanted to play this game specifically for the painterly style. And yeah, there's a couple games that I'm interested in in that same way. But let's just get into Unleaving today and let's check this thing out. Features thousands of pencil, graphite, and acrylic visuals. Oh, I'm ready. This is already so beautiful. Awake, why are you here? Oh, what is happening? Your home. I'm using a Nintendo Switch similar controller. Y'all, y'all know this. So, any of the Xbox related. Um, buttons you see are not what I'm technically pressing. There's definitely some puzzles ah, related to this. Oh, here we go. Wow, I couldn't get a hold of that. Oh, okay, that's as far as it goes. We're gonna run and jump. Here we go. But you are lost. I am home, but I am lost. Is that what it said? This is beautiful, by the way. Descent, how do you begin? I mean, look how... Her facial features aren't there anymore. 
But her hair is that, it's that swoosh. Oh, there goes the butterfly again. Into the well. Oh, wow. What do you search for? I don't know. Absurd. And she's so cute as well. Well, that was stunning. <gasps> oh no, please. Oh, well, we can't swim. <laughs> Okay. Trying to think big brain. And I think we need momentum because the flow of the water and this wind is making it very difficult. So there goes that. Oh my god. Oh my god. It had to work so quickly. <laughs> oh jeez. Okay. Oh no, not this above us. Dog. Oh no, that we saw that shadow earlier. Is Are we going to have somebody? <gasps> oh, there it is. Oh no, what do we do? Oh shoot. Oh, I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Oh, shoot. Oh, I get it. I didn't realize that was uh, a blade, essentially. Um... Shoot. Okay, I did not time that right. Okay. Oh, what the? Boom. Back up. <laughs> Not today, dog. Not today. Okay, we need something heavy. Is there anything here we can take with us? The only thing that is movable is this unfortunate dog carcass. And I... Oh, okay. This is very morbid. <laughs> I need to put a disclaimer maybe at the start. Uh, dark theming. Viewers beware. I could not do this IRL, by the way. Could not. Is 
the heavy dog. Oh, we get to zoom in on her a little bit. Get to see a little bit more of her. I like the contrast of her being red versus all of the earth tones. I know that was probably purposefully. Twin, what dulls your fears? Are we twins? I guess she did have red hair, huh? Okay, okay. It's telling me to go that way in the hint, so maybe we will leave that for now. I was wondering because the leaf is over here if this is the direction. I just happen to go that way, so let's just go down. Okay, what is this? Oh, maybe we needed this extra box. Okay, the water's going up, but why? <laughs> is this a good idea or is this a bad idea? Oh no, we can't swim. Oh, we can't swim. Oh, we- wait, we can't- Okay, we can't swim, so what the heck do we do here? Let me just try one more thing. I have a feeling this box is just gonna stay stuck here, though. Hmm... Okay, it needed more momentum, okay. That's fine, I get it. Ah, shoot. Oh no, I'm a- I know what to do. I just have to execute it right. Okay, y'all, leave me be. Some games uh, can be a little bit finicky. Not saying this one is. It's very pretty. But I'm not the best platformer, especially, uh, Puzzle games. Sometimes they do get me stuck. But it didn't work! Maybe I just need to leave it be. Instead of going down there and potentially drowning, maybe I just need to let the box do its thing and it will reach me up this way because I, I get too impatient. Yeah, look at that, like an elevator. Slow and steady. Oh my gosh. All I had to do was wait up here instead of going down there. Why did I go down there? That was a rookie move. Okay, so we have an extra box now. I still weigh this down, though. And this thing's heavy compared to me. Well, I mean, I'm heavy compared to the boxes. Y'all know what I mean. Oh no, predicament. <laughs> as soon as I get this box over here, that weighs less. And then I get this, go back up here. Like, I have to move super quickly then, yeah? And I don't want to play a whole lot of this game today, y'all, because um, it's not a huge long experience. So I don't want to show y'all too much of the game. Perfect. Ugh, just so you can get out of here. <laughs> Goodness. Leaf, we have made it. Oh my god. That is our twin. 
Also very terrifying. Holy crap. Wow. A lot going on here. Well, now I feel like I have to ring the bell, right? Uh, everything's on fire now? Okay, I know we're on a cliffhanger here and it is quite scary to see my character up in the top, but this is not the easiest of games, if I may be fair. I have attempted this little thing. I know what I need to do. I just don't know if it's a me problem or if it's just a little bit touchy. I am using a non-Xbox controller and it, a little thing just popped up. Yeah, I see. That's exactly what I was trying to do. So there's a string inside of this bell. And so I stand on top of the hammer and I try to reach for the string, but I don't know at what point, what timing I'm supposed to do to reach it. So maybe I just need to climb it. I'm going to attempt this one more time. The bell like raises up. And yeah, see, definitely have no idea. And I am going to end it here for today. Like I said, this is not a very long experience. I think walkthroughs that I have seen on YouTube are like an hour max maybe, but that's if you know what you're doing um, and they might be cut down as well. So it might be like three hours tops for this game. So I don't want to showcase a whole lot of it. So that is unleaving just first thoughts on it beautiful beautiful game i love the painterly very artistic style of it i like the contrast of the red against all of these earth tones it seems like there's definitely some deep thoughts and feelings going into this game and probably some things to think about when you finish as well because it is like there's an underlining sorrow there that I'm seeing, even though you are kind of a red color, which in my opinion kind of makes me think of more anger than sorrow, but the whole landscape is more sorrowful. Again, I want to give a big thanks to the publisher slash dev for providing me a code to show this to y'all. I'm excited to finish it off. It's, it isn't easy, <laughs> the platforming and puzzles here. As you can see, I, I've struggled quite a bit, but it, you know, games don't have to be easy, especially if they are shorter experiences. Like I said, all the links are in the description box below. If you are interested in Unleaving, go check it out for yourself. But thank you so much for watching.